And now I would like to invite to stage Her Royal Highness, Princess Sonam Jechen Wanchuk of the Kingdom of Bhutan, someone I had the privilege of knowing when we were at Stanford together, as well as Hugh Vary of White and Case. Since the first general parliamentary elections in 2008, the Kingdom of Bhutan has seen lasting democratic stability, has made significant progress in empowering existing legal institutions to support its developing rule of law. However, there is currently no law school in the Kingdom of Bhutan, and the country must rely on foreign judges and lawyers who often are unfamiliar with the specific needs and priorities of the Kingdom. White and Case today is committing to partner with the government of Bhutan to create the country's very first law school, which will serve as a center for research and analysis, focusing on the evolving needs of the country, as well as to develop expertise in certain areas that are in alignment with the country's priorities, particularly around environmental law and sustainable development. In partnership, the government of India has committed $9 million to construct the campus. Notably, the law school will actively recruit women because the kingdom is committed to having an equal number of male and female lawyers to help serve its future. The goal of the law school is eventually to support and enroll 200 full-time students with the support of more than 100 faculty, staff, and visiting researchers. This is incredibly exciting. We're so grateful to White and Case and the government of India and to the continued visionary leadership from the Kingdom of Bhutan. Please give them a round of applause.